Elon Musk is considered one of the greatest, most innovative entrepreneurs to have lived. Our generation has been blessed with his genius and relative eccentric nature. That eccentric nature has led him to create some magnificent creations, from the Tesla car, his own space program, amongst many more things. Now he's on to his new grand mission, a gigafactory worth $5 billion. Welcome to Brainy Peach. As we get into this amazing and, in some people's opinion, the most reckless idea ever conceived by Elon Musk yet. The Gigafactory is close to Reno, Nevada. The reported cost for this great factory was Tesla's $5 billion, 3.8 billion pounds, 3,200 acre battery manufacturing plant. Panasonic, who has been working with Tesla in making Tesla's batteries, invested just under 2 billion in this plant. When fully built, it'll be the biggest factory in the world. It'll contribute to the making of 500,000 electric cars a year and 10,000 jobs to the surrounding area. You may wonder where the sales will come from to even feed this factory, but Elon Musk was always ahead of the curve. He knew that as time passed, the United States required car makers to sell more low and zero emission vehicles. Elon Musk knew the supply of his batteries would increase dramatically, so it was best to put down the investment long before he was running to expand his business operations. Are you enjoying the video? Then give us a thumbs up, subscribe, and hit that notification bell. Let's continue. The planned benefit of this factory was that it will cut out his global chain production costs by 30%. It is a suitable investment, especially if it gives such a high cost benefit for the foreseeable future. Plus, that will place Tesla in a position to mass produce their batteries and his vision to increase their market share to a truly global level. After all, the manufacturing industry is known for its high cost margins. The construction on the Giga factory began in June of 2014. The factory is being built section by section, so some manufacturing could begin before other parts of the site are finished. In one section of the factory, Panasonic will start the process of making the battery cells before carried over to Tesla in another section of the building. It will be partially powered by solar-powered systems. The batteries will be more efficiently made from the materials of graphite, cobalt, and lithium, with cobalt being the hardest to source, since half of the world's production comes from the Domestic Republic of Congo. Elon Musk wanted to have more than one gigafactory though, as he said to reporters. He was not content with one gigafactory. No, what he really needed was one in Europe, in India, in China. Ultimately, wherever there's a huge demand for the end product. Where the shipping costs start to become significant, the obvious way to combat that is to at least put a gigafactory on the same continent. With his dream to monopolize the electric vehicle industry, he wants to create a fleet of self-driving Teslas in every city and town to compete with Uber and his own ego. When asked how much his master plan might cost to implement, Mr. Musk replied, tens of billions. Elon Musk's company, Tesla, had a lot of ups and downs for a long while, but Elon Musk's charisma has made it easy for him to avoid scrutiny and get investors to believe in him even when the financials have not matched it. Especially the impact of being the center of low-cost energy storage, a huge prospect that entices many investors that will also have the new line of electric cars compete with common cars. Elon Musk has been known to beat his critics, and if there's one thing we've learned, when it comes to Elon Musk, if he's going all in, he's confident for a reason. So, what do you think? Do you think Elon Musk will achieve his goals? Any new ideas for videos? Well, put it down in the comments. Who knows, we might take your idea and give you credit. Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe, like, hit that notification bell so that you can get notifications when we put out a new video. We really appreciate your support and all your comments. Thank you again and see you next time.